Well, how do there, chums? Says I, Captain of the Steves. And today, chums, I'm in light, no sky. Now, there's been a bit of news. Ghost Light took out a member of the 07 Brew crew in his latest video. Now, I've made everybody aware that this has taken place instead of the 07 Brew crew. I've said if Ghost Light opens fire on any members of the 07 crew, brew crew to fire back in fact fire back first yeah get the first shot in because he actually managed to take out a member of the 07 brew crew in two shots admittedly though the person that ghost actually ghosted on the 07 brew crew is not someone that i've seen online all too often so i really don't know what's going on there i still don't know whether this is a double bluff or what's going on Ghostlight's not the easiest person to get in contact with for the nature of his work. So, yeah, I'm having a hard time understanding what's going on myself. But anyway, what I figured I'm going to do is I'm going to fly over to the Creola Kingdom. You know, I haven't been there myself. All this shenanigans is going on right now. There's a worker geck right there. There you go, CK, CK. I wonder what this guy's doing right now. Okay, well, he looks like he's got his PvP on, my PvP's on. I'll fly on over and we'll see if we can stir up a bit of trouble, I guess, people. Let's fly on over then. Let's take my little dragon. Let's fly, my little pretty. Let's see if we can get there before he disconnects. You know, it's an hour's flight for me. I mean, if I have one of those giant airworms or cynicals, I could be there lickety split, couldn't I? Okay, right, there's, a, there's another uh, marker over there now as well. I wonder who that is. Let's have a look at the network settings. Network. View nearby player list. Not seeing anybody else from the CK Kingdom. These are all 07 Brew Crew members. But I figured I might go over there. Have a look at the old Creole Kingdom myself. See if we can sit on Cynical's throne. Get a lovely little picture or something. Could be quite nice, couldn't it? Mm, there's a building there. Sweet. I mean, if I do see any buildings of interest, I'm probably not going to bother stopping at them. Unless it's another colossal archive, could create another little arena. That'd be quite cool. But other than that, I'm not really fussed about buildings. Okay, anyway, I'll let you know if anything interesting happens on my flight over. You see, when it comes to good old Ghostlight, you know, he actually, the first we heard of this whole spy thing was Cynical woke up one morning and found a big ghost light logo off of his balcony and a big number seven. And then Cynical actually went and done something rather curious. He built a box over the seven and put, yeah, ghost light is my spy. I mean, why announce it to the world at that point? The thing that I found a little bit weird about all this is Cynical would have had build rights to do that box over it. So I've... Uh, you know, Ghostlight has hit him up and said, you know, let's do this, let's do that. And they are working in cahoots. They are in collaboration. Or maybe it was a genuine mistake by Ghostlight. Maybe he left the build rights on. But I think it's more likely that Professor Cynical put the base computer down and let Ghost build there and upload and claim it. I think that they are in collusion. I do think there is some skullduggery and shenanigans going on here, people. But at the same time, I have hit up Ghostlight and said, what's going on? And Ghost said, well, look, you know, let's just have a little bit of entertainment. Let's have a little bit of fun. I don't think he's actually decided which way he's going to go with this shenanigans. He just wants to have a little bit of drama, a little bit of intrigue stirred up. I mean, we've got a long time until the 5th of July to get ourselves ready for the combat this time around. So, you know, we're hoping to end this a week before the expedition ends, basically, is what we're hoping to do. Because then we're thinking that, you know, maybe there might be something from the hello of the games. But anyway, people, um, that's... Oh, Jesus Christ, that just gave me a heart attack. That was a big boom in my ears when they zoomed in. I thought I was getting shot at. Right, anyway, peeps, I'm going I'm to carry on flying over this way. But all I'm saying is, I honestly don't know what's going on with um, Ghostlight. I've tried hitting him up. Last I heard, it was like, you know, Captain Steve, let's just uh, let's just float with it. You know, Cynical wants me as a spy. Let's see how badly he wants me as a spy. I I'm going to go and I'm going to take on that role. 
I was like, uh, are you sure you want to do that? Uh, you know, you might have the 07 crew gunning for you. And again, if you're not lucky, you're going to have Cynical's crew gunning for you. He said, well, it'd be bloody entertaining. I'm like, all right, fine. Do what you like, Mr. Ghost. I said, but, you know, if you do run into any trouble, get yourself back here lickety split. Well, I'm doing the flight over there just to see just how much trouble it would be for him to escape. And he has got quite a swathe of landscape to get across if he does need to escape. Now, I am hoping that he comes online, because if he comes online, I can then invite him into a chat, talk to him in person, and just say, look, you know, what the fudge is going on? Do you need to get back to the 07 crew? OK, well, let's have a little recce. You're going to have to earn your way back by giving us knowledge and information, my little friend. Yeah, like that. But at the same time, I need to understand who was this 07 Brew crew member that they gunned down? Was there any sort of death pardon between him and said... 07 crew member. Oh, look at this. We've just found ourselves a colossal archive in between here. Oh, hold on. This looks like it's been claimed by S. Okay, so this is the base already claimed by the Creola Kingdom, by the looks of things, people. I wonder if I can put a base at the opposite side and also claim it. If I go all the way over here. No, I wouldn't want to try that, just in case they try the same shenanigans on us. That would be a little bit mental, wouldn't it? Anyways, um, I don't know whether that player is still online anymore. Well, it looks like they might be over here. It looks like they've come away from their base a bit. Let's just land and let's just do a little recce. No, that's Jackpot Ninja. Aha, there we go. Whoops, I put down a beacon. I wanted to lock onto him. Ah, I can't. I can't actually lock onto a player. You can tell I do this often. Right. Okay. I want to get rid of that beacon now. Okay. Right. Where's my Where's my dragon? Anyway, people, I continue flying. But I, I just wanted you to go through my thought pattern with everything that's going on. With um, good old ghost light. I mean, it's been interesting. Uh, definitely interesting. Okay. Let's head on over then. Join the Crayola Kingdom to run and hide. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Now that he has been outed as a spy, held out in my cynical wild wife. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Is he a double agent? Nobody knows. Part of the 07 crew, the crew he chooses. Come back, ghost light. Come back by night. Ghost, if you're a double agent, please don't die. And if you're a Crayola, that means you was an 07 spy. Have to part ways and say goodbye. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Went on over to take a look at Cynical Base, where this roof's did cook. Didn't find him there, signed Cynical's guest book. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Hope Cynical gets the messages as he tours his home. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Oh, seven Cynical. Oh, seven John. Oh, seven John. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Is he a double agent? Nobody knows. Part of the 07 crew. The crew, he crew, he chose. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Ghost 
ghost if you're a double A, please don't die. And if you're a Crayola, that means you was an 07 spot. Have to part ways and say goodbye. Come back, ghost life. Come back, my night. Come back, ghost life. Come back, my night. Went on over to take a look at Cynical Base, where this roost did cook. Didn't find him there. Sign Cynical's guest book. Come back, ghost life. Hope Cynical gets the messages as he tours his home. Come back, ghost life, back, ghost life, oh, seven foot. Hope Cynical gets the messages as he tours his home. Come back, ghost life, come back, my night. Hope Cynical gets the messages as he tours his home. Let's go and have a look at this because this looks blinking big. Oh, that's Bupke's base. Bupke done very well last season. Very cool base, Bupke. And again, your base last time was as well, wasn't it? But yeah, I'm not. I'm not seeing any, any people about. And to be honest, when I log in, in season one, I was like, oh my god, let's just see how many people from Cynical's militia are on. Oh, that is actually really quite cool, that base, isn't it? Very nice. Yeah, I'm not seeing any... I'm not seeing much activity, really. I think a lot of people are just lying low. Until... Oh, look, there's Ghost Light's Ghost! All right, well, let's uh, let's head on over there. Let's have a look at all this. And oh, look, I'm not seeing the box around it that Cynical put on it. I'm, I'm seeing as it was. Heck, yeah! Way to go, Ghost, which means we must be close to Cynical's base. Viking at arms. Cool. Well, I'm just running around in, inside of here, pretty much unchallenged right now. And it, the odd thing is, is I know that Cynical could see this from his window. So his base must be somewhere in this canyon. But as you can see here, look, people, I don't see anything. Nothing at all, no bases. But I think this is where Cynical's base is. Roughly where that comms ball might be, I guess. Let's go back down to that comms ball. If is, it, is it the same one that I came past before? Because I bet you this is, this is roughly where his base is then. So I'm thinking his base must be somewhere around here. Because there's ghost lights right there. Yeah, Cynical's base must be where this comms ball is. Alright. Well, if his base is here, and I'm just not seeing it, let's, um, let's join in with the comms ball shenanigans, shall we, people? Um, right, comms ball. Just need some pure ferrite, okay. Let's uh, just there you go, some right here. I do. We'll be having that. Boom. Okay, and gave me a geode. Right, let's um. Yeah, that was me, Sentinel. We go for a red one, and we make it look like it's been here for time. Rusted. There we go. Right. Let's put down a little comms ball. Leave message. Uh, Captain Steve. Rules. There you go. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, actually, he criticised us for not being able to spell last time, didn't he? One second. There uh, yeah. 
Captain Steve rules. There we go. I do. Uh, seven brew. Whatever. Spelt wrong on purpose. Okay, there we go. Cool. That's like that, what people used to write in the old 80s and stuff, you know. But anyway, hopefully he'll wake up in the morning. I'm hoping this is right by his freaking throne room. That'd be bloody awesome if it is. Imagine that every time he sits on his throne, it just pops up with that. In fact, I could just stick comms balls everywhere while I'm here, couldn't I? I mean, there's... I don't think there's any limit to how many comms balls I can put down. I mean, I can't see his base, so... You know, it could be here, it could be there. I'm thinking it's somewhere around here. I'll put another one right here, I think. Let's, uh, let's see if we can do that. Oh, I can. This is nice. I'm going to stick that one there, then. Yeah, we'll have that. There we go. Boom. Uh, what message shall I leave? Any message? Oh, seven. Brew. Get it at Cheres. Oh, how do I spell Cherezina? <laughs> One second, people. Here we go. O seven 7 Brew. Yes, I've got my own brew of tea. Some people think I'm joking when I say that. No, I haven't. I, I honestly do have my own brew of tea. Cherezina. Dot. Go. Dot. You. Go. There you go. <laughs> right, there we are. So we got that there. Um, yeah. We could put another one maybe here. Yeah, we can put one there. Uh, kind of works. We'll put one there. Oh, I heard something land. At least, oh, look, there's a trader over there. Jordan Tops, only 217 years away. Oh, hopefully he's, he's getting himself something. Right, anyway, let's um, let's go put a little message in this one. Da -da 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 -da. Message. Right, well, I think we've got a good lot of um, comms balls there, just to keep him entertained. We've, we've left him, we've left him a few nice little messages, I think. Oh, hello there! Oh, you gave me a Blaze Javelin module. I honestly don't need it though, uh, Mr. Jord on top. Thank you very much, though. Cheers. Okay, right. I better get back on my um, get back on my old uh, bird, and let's uh, fly out of here. Let's go. Meow. And I'm heading home. So I'm hoping that's where Professor Cynical's base is. And I'm hoping that he gets all those lovely messages that I carefully crafted for him lovingly with my own hands. Okay, well, I'm doing a little bit of testing just to see if you can pick up the ceiling fan noise on my mic or whether my noise gate cuts it out. I'm hoping it does cut it out because this is actually making my room nice and cool. It's making my... um green screen wobble quite a bit but this seems okay as well but yeah this is just a test for audio purposes and oh, jordan top just overtook me on his worm his worm's super fast look at his worm go i mean he's he's gone already so yeah cynical could catch me on his worm fairly quickly but it looks like jord's got a fairly fast worm also look at him go very cool okay well, chums, when I've made it back to my actual base, and that's something I haven't actually checked out at this base, is this cave right next to it. Let's have a look inside of here. Let's just see how deep this goes. And to see if it's any good. Well, this is quite cool in here. Very nice. Very nice indeed. 
I've got a massive abundance of freaking. Oh look, vortex cubes. I've got loads of vortex cubes. There's a whole bundle of them over there. This is deep, man. This is cool. Anyway, I won't go too deep or else I might get lost, but what an absolutely epic cave. Alright, people. Uh, I better get myself out of here before I yeah, before I get lost. Well chums, I did go online to see if I could sort of, you know, hit up ghost light, but that didn't go to fruition. So instead we went over to the Crayola Kingdom. I left down some lovely messages for the Crayola King. I hope he liked them. Um <laughs> But yeah, it is what it is. I just made a video. I had to make a video while I was there. How could I not? You know? It's getting quite late my time, at ten of the PMs. So yeah, at least I spent my time wisely, I suppose. But I am thinking a lot of people might not be online because they're actually ready now for the PvP aspect and maybe they're just now waiting for the 5th of July. So I'm thinking maybe have a word with Ricey and Cynical, see if they want to bring that date forwards. Maybe move it to this weekend or something. I, I don't know. But then again, we're not too far away from the 5th of July now, are we? It was, it's like two weeks, but maybe we should move it a little bit closer. A little bit closer. Anyway, people, salute to Mondo. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again. Both life has defected to the other side Join the Quill of Kingdom to run and hide Come back, ghost life Come back, my knight Now that he has been outed as a spy Held out of our cynical wild wife Come back, ghost life Come back, my knight. Is he a double agent? Nobody knows. Part of the 07 crew, the crew he chooses. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my knight. Ghost, if you're a double agent, please don't die. And if you're a Crayola, that means you was an 07 spy. Have to part ways and say goodbye. Come back, ghost light. Come back, my night. Went on over to take a look at Cynical Base, where this roost did cook. Didn't find him there.